Hi everyone, it's Nick from Peace, Love, and Happiness Club. Hope you've been doing well. Today we got a special on Perch Candles. I want to tell you a little bit about each of our favorite fragrances and also what situations you want to bring them in. So a little background on Perch Candle House and how they developed these incredible fragrances. They were designed by Art Maruyama, who's known as a bit of a visionary in the fragrance community. Uh, he started using soy wax really before it was popular, which is interesting because most candles you'll find are soy wax, but these are actually apricot wax. So that's another reason why they're really ahead of the game with this one. So the power of apricot wax is that you're gonna have less soot and less smoke coming from the candle. So it's a very clean burn. Moving on, let's look at a few of my favorite fragrances and some of our best-selling ones. Um, and I'll tell you a little bit about each one. So with Wisteria Woods, you are really getting a floral texture. So it, the way that they describe it on the website is blooming wisteria with white peony, soft lily, and amber wood. Okay, moving on, the Lotus Lily is a little bit more exotic, I would say, than the Wisteria Woods. It is still floral, but with this one, you're getting a hint of amber and vanilla musk. So it makes it a little bit more exotic as a fragrance. Look up close there to the apricot wax. Moving on, we've got the Tamarind Fur, and if you've never smelled this one before, it has a very woodsy texture, it's a little bit different than the floral we just looked at. Here is the lid cover, which I love the design that they do on these. Uh, we're getting a little bit more of a woodsy blend. We've got the fur, the cedar, the agar wood, but also you're hit with that clove, which makes it a little bit spicy as well. So it almost feels like you're walking through the woods would be a good way that I would describe this scent. Moving on to one of my favorites. This is the Grapefruit Acacia, as you can see. I'll show you the design on the lid there, which they do such a good job on. What you have to know about the Grapefruit Acacia is that it's a little bit more, let's say zesty. It has this hint of floral and also moss. You hit with the grapefruit immediately for sure. So it definitely has that, you know, in the garden feel of a fresh grapefruit. Finally, we're gonna look at the lemon rosemary, which you see here. I'll show you the lid design there, some classic lemons. So the lemon rosemary amber is very nice for kind of a soft, clean fragrance, I would say. So for your bathroom or anywhere you wanna have just like a freshness kind of lingering. Um, it's got lemon, verbena, rosemary, and just a hint of vanilla bean at the end. 